Hello friends, this is Abril. I'm coming here today to share with you uh, my <clears throat> trinket box that I completed from a, a Rosie Posy kit. Uh, <clears throat> this kit is I think from like May. Uh, I am behind um, several kits. Uh, the, the first one that I've, I, I've purchased and I've, I've completed was uh, uh, stick pin book and uh, I didn't do a video on that one I just posted pictures online but if you guys want me to do a video on it um, just uh, say say yes down below and I'll go ahead and do a video on it but for now I'm gonna go ahead and show you my trinket box uh, <clears throat> this is it this is the front of it and then here's the the side um, and then this other side and uh, I the kit included these metal corners and I went ahead and uh, did uh because they were silver I added some of this metallic uh, uh, wax in the H brass to it so they could look a little bit more um, a little bit browner not so shiny um, so I went ahead and added that I just with the box in white and then this this fabric was included in the in the kit so I uh, mod podge that on on the sides and the front this was a, a different part of the like the top part and then the bottom part of the of this same fabric so I did that to the front and then I did this uh, this is a little something she always includes a little something in her kit and this is my my little something that was included so I went ahead and added it to the front of the where you open the box and then as soon, when you open the box from that same fabric I cut out that border and I made a frame and then I um, put two flowers on each side and then they're the same I, I mod podged on here and then it says be gentle with yourself and others and it is by uh, Charlene Constanzo I think it's a no I don't think it's an A but um, I'm, I'm not too sure but that was also, all of this that I'm showing you was included in the kit. So were these napkins that I mop potched on onto the box. Those were also included in the kit. And I used them there and in the bottom. And then those little feet were also included in the kit. And then um, right here I added this lace to, to the to the bottom of the of the sorry box but, and I also added it here to the bottom and on the inside wall here I also added a piece of lace and I'm not sure oh there you go you'll be able to see it there and then on the inside the only thing that was mine from the from everything besides right the glue uh, was this um, pink felt on the bottom of it I added the pink felt just in case I don't know like I wanted to add just to complete it actually and then this fabric was also in the kit and I mod potched all the the sides of the box I mod potched the fabric in all the sides of the box so and then I added that lace also that lace that was included in the kit to the inside here just to finish it off but that is my trinket box and uh, I am actually pretty happy with the way it turned out and let me show you the, the, the top of it which is my favorite part she had sent ouch she had sent these doilies so I and these flowers 
I went ahead and, and all these little thingies. I went ahead and added the where's the the, the doilies. I, I glued them on and then I hot glued these pieces on here and this little strand of pearls and these little flat back little flowers and this little pin um, this is made with this little heart this is made with love and that that's a little bow could be an angel too if you if you add a little head to it right and then buttons so I went ahead and added like that stuff to me you know how like you put your jewelry on top of your dresser drawers or something or, or jewelry box so that's how I uh, went ahead and added that like that and then I just wanted to add the flowers for a touch of uh, a decoration and to kind of finish it off but uh, what do you all think? Um, I'm having a lot of fun working on these kits um, I'm glad I got on her permanent list because then that way I get all the all of her kits. I wish I was like Edie Beedie Angie that puts her beautiful pictures of her projects at the end of her camera uh, at the end of her video. When I grow up, I'll I'll learn how to edit videos like that. For right now, it's just it's just fun. In the bottom, the little feet. So yeah, I can't wait to start um, using it for storage, and sh um, I'm gonna probably keep my leftover rosy posy stuff because I had a lot of leftover. She sent this fabric. It's two pieces of pink lace and a, and an ivory lace, and then I had some of the trim leftover. And uh, some of this stuff left over that I just didn't know where to add it, so and I didn't want it to be. And then this beautiful piece that I didn't get to use this time on my box, but um, I will. And then these two flowers, so she sent you tons of stuff. And then here's these flowers that were left over. And then this is the only piece of the fabric that I had left over from the what I used to frame the the quote and the this part of the box, the white fabric. And then these little flowers. And then a ton of napkins there's two different kinds of napkins and then that piece of fabric is what I had left over so um, I'm gonna put her information down below so that if you guys are interested in her kits I think there's a lot of people on her permanent list now and she might have maybe like three four four slots or, or less available for her permanent but you could always just like if you watch her life you could get like if it's available, you could tell her you want one, and then she'll just send you a bill. But, um, yeah, I'll put down her information, and then also uh, for Laurel Nakudis, who is Forever Purple Creations by Laura. Um, I'll go ahead, and because you could get a hold of Rosie through her. So, yes, um, let me show you real quick the outside of my stick pin book. This is the outside. Um, I made it a, like a corset like. So that's the first kit that I completed and, and purchased from her. So um, thank you very much for stopping by and uh, um, for watching my videos. I truly appreciate it. And uh, if you want to see a video on the, on the stick pin book, uh, just go ahead and comment below. And I'll go ahead and make one. Um, love and blessings to you always. Bye-bye.